Hello everybody and welcome back to Full Metal Otaku Who Plays Game Dev Tycoon Episode 3. Let's jump right into it. Alright, so we got 2.6 in the bank. So what have we done? Analysis on our last level. What have, what have we done recently? The castles have been really well. Tentacle Slayer was a 9.5. Alright. Let's make a new game. Medium game. Read it. What, what, what game engine? No, not game engine. What uh, platforms are at the top of the market right now? Oh, the PlayStation. The Play System just came out. Maybe we should make something on the play system. The play system. Not to be confused with the PlayStation. Um, oh yeah, I know what we're doing. We're, we're making uh, one of one of the most well known games of all time. Making a Final Fantasy 7 for the play system. Oh, but we can't make Final Fantasy 7. We don't have all the right stuff. We need to make a new, uh, new custom engine. Oh, do we not have back? We don't have a uh, 3D graphics research. We'll get there. We're gonna make Final Fantasy VII as our next game. It's happening. Searching sequels as well, even though Final Fantasy VII you can't really technically call it a sequel. It's 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 a follow up to the other Final Fantasy games, but it's not a direct sequel. It's not the same universe, really. I mean, I think there are arguments that have been made that they're all in the same universe. They're just on different planets or different spots in the timeline or something. But oh yeah, let's get the. Let's get the medium booth. Let's uh, start work on our engine. We need the 3D graphics. We need the cutscenes. We don't need multiplayer for this game, but we're gonna get multiplayer anyways. Dialogue. Don't need level editor for this, but we're getting it anyways. Open world. Mono sound. The, the box soft engine. With that, the game gear is no longer supported. Yeah, we don't we don't care about that. We don't care about the game gear. Alright. Cool.
I mean, tech, it's almost more cyberpunk than, um, well, it's like steampunk. It doesn't really fit exactly in there, but we're doing it anyways. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta hit our window. It's releasing, uh, by not be fun to shoot seven while the, uh, PlayStation is still new and dear to our hearts. Storing quest, very important. Um, we do need cutscenes. We'll leave it there, even though we don't really need. No, we'll take it out. We want. We want to do this right. All right. So we got story and quest are one of our design lords. Yep. Uh, we got gameplay. Yeah, that's fine. And then he's gonna be one of our tech guys. Yeah, that's fine. Oh yeah. Type game. Design, yes. We gotta have the good soundtrack too, though. We gotta go with the balanced approach here. Um, there's James. James is our graphics guy. And Bill's our graphics guy. Question is, are we over heights? Or are we just the right amount of height? Because we're definitely right. It could be the best game of all time, or it could not be. I think there are uh, arguments going either way. Kidding me? Bro. I'm a little pissed.
Well, maybe we should do that then. Maybe we should find some publishing deals until we can uh, get our fan base up. Alright. Prison strategy game, game size medium. Let's do that. That sounds like a good idea, actually. use of our new engine. Uh, we're gonna name this after a character from an anime that I've been watching recently. Uh, One Punch Man. One of the characters is a uh, Puri Puri Prisna. He's uh, basically a creepy pedophile that ended up in jail. Seems like a good thing to name a game after. Let's get this one multiplayer. Strategy games need multiplayer. Um, so what do we what do we need in order to get all this to happen? We need gameplay up. The engine up some, we need story quest up some. The engine's like supposedly somewhat important, so we'll, we'll do like. That, I guess. Um, engine's gonna be one of the tech people, let's put James on it. Gameplay, need a mixed bag, and story quest is gonna be. Yeah, we're gonna have James do double duty on this one. Actually, no. Let the main character do double duty on it. Double duty. Spearheading the project. Dialogue, not important. Level design. And our strategy game is going to be relatively important. AI is going to be relatively important as well. Um, let's back off the level design a little bit and just put me up to 99% on there. And then AI is going to be tech. Dialogue, we'll put Bill Bright on dialogue. Bill Bright. He's a bright guy. Yeah. Graphics are not super important, but like we have to because we've got the V3 graphics going. They won't let us back down off of our V3 graphics. I need to remember in the future when doing strategy games that maybe I don't need the super fancy graphics. when we hit our seven uh, for our scores. Oh shit. I can do that. Give me an eight. Fucking seven. Give me an eight. Give me a nine. Ooh. What the fuck? Oh, cool. I thought that it, 
said that I had a PS7, but I guess, I guess not. The Super Nintendo. Super Nintendo and Entertainment System. Alright, what else can we research? We need to do some new topics again. Sure. a sequel to one of our uh, wildly successful games, Cynical Slayer. On the PC. Good graphics. Doesn't need multiplayer. Slayer 2, soon to be released. Give me hype. Yeah, we've got over a hundred thousand people at our thing. It's like 20,000 more than last year, even though we haven't released any good games. It's changing soon. Tentacle Slayer 2. Sand to a Toys R Us near you. I don't care about sound so much. Um, go on sound. Jimmy on world sound. I like that. That's Renee on sound. Yeah, there we go. Because we, we had him almost maxed out. That makes sense. Tentacles. We had to add a lot of sensor bars to the uh, the game over screens, but the critics appreciated it anyways. But look at it. Look at I'm telling you, all you gotta do is put out tentacle porn and all the critics just eat it off. Look at that. Are we getting a perfect score? The straight tens. All games plus screwing me out of the perfect score. Let's see. So 
let's get some more research going. These, I mean, these guys are tired. So we can hit up dialogue trees, redemption stories. Yeah, we'll get some AC going. I mean, we've got the number one game selling right now. I think we can afford a little bit of air conditioning. So let's do another publishing deal done. How many fans do we have? We've got 746 fans. We have an RPG, any topic RPG on the Super Nintendo. Ultimate history, history action game. Actually, hold up. We don't want to release another RPG right now. So we're gonna make a alternate history. I shot the mayor for the play system ready to be for everybody. Oh, let's just use the good engine. Action game. We want the good graphics. Ooh, let's, let's do some more on the 3D graphics. We should be able to get um, 3D graphics too off of that one and research that up. Engine Importante. Gameplay also Importante. Eh, fuck the story. It's an action game. They don't need story. It's an action game with multiplayer. Oh. Getting fancy. Engine. Gameplay. Save ourselves for uh, important jobs. This dialogue is not important. AI yeah, can, I can serve with important, sir. The graphics. The graphics are important. Um, I feel like world design is somewhat important. Yeah. Do like that. Do it just like that. I'm 
Equal Slayer 2 sold almost 2 million units. He's got cash A in the bank. Christ. Well, that's okay. Um, so what do we need? We need another on. Um... We need another guy. Derpishin. And you guys are all going on on vacation. What's next on the blog? Everything's great. Let's get a 5.5 or a 5.0 because everything's great. Yay! game based on um, that, that one expansion of what it's done with the doing that. Yeah. What's going on with PC? It's a mature game. It's a strategy game, so we're using the, the B2 and not the B3 graphics because we don't need the We actually have another design guy now, which helps. Um, let's put it out there. You like that? You like that? 
So other than One Punch Man, we've also been watching um, a couple of other anime recently. The the Naruto sequel, I guess. Boruto just started off. There are like three episodes in, and it's it's all right. We've also been watching um, My Hero Academia. Is top notch, top notch. I'd say one of the best anime that's released in the last few years, anyways. Design. Bill's our man, dude. Bill's, Bill's a design god. Um, okay, you can work on dialogue. We're giving him things to do. Oh, we probably should have done more with the AI. It's gonna come back and bite us in the ass. Oh, it's been close enough attention. Screwing the game. Yo, I like told them to not hype it. Why do I have like 60 freaking hype right now? Sound is important. World design is also important. Um, sound. Prefix. Yeah, it's a Sega system. That, that one Sega system. Of course, Sega got destroyed in the uh, the console wars, which is really too bad. They had some cool stuff going. On. work on our computer system. Oh yeah, dude, pay it up. Let's upgrade our computer system. Oh, look at that, man. Our office looks so schmancy. Oh, look at that. Call it Katoon getting them, them sixes. I thought it was going to go higher than that, actually. It's okay. We only need a five on this one for our uh, contract. So long as that's not lower than a four on the last one, we're good. Alright, cool. Well, we've successfully made our most successful uh, game a sequel, and the sequel did stupidly well, so. Biggest meetup game developers are starting off for different game developers' challenges throughout the year. Game devs are not able to compete with each other. Well, that's cool. I don't know if I've seen this before. Um, make our games report and let's do some research on some stuff. Do stuff research. Like advanced cutscenes. Security upgrades? Yeah, sure, dude. We're gonna take all the upgrade things that we can. Stereo sound. You know, they got themselves a little like 
entertainment area in the corner with freaking bean chairs. That's pretty cool. Gordon's strategy is a bad combination. I'm not surprised by that. And they're drawing on the windows. And playing Tetris and Galaga. And Space Invaders. There we go. That one. Same thing. Boss fights. <laughs> Uh oh, so let's do one more research thing. Actually, yeah, let's just do uh, some new topics. Let me start training this guy a little bit. Oh, those are, um... So let's see, what are, what are all these things that we've unlocked as far as uh, here? We've got pirates, time travel, werewolves, sports, business. I can make a business simulation game. We're gonna make a business simulation game on the... Is the game link still around? It's still got good market share, but it's actually not. Let's do it on the play system. For everybody. And, uh, what's this gonna be? It's a business sim game. Probably gonna be our last game of the night. It's just a small game. Not as large as some of our other projects. Yeah, doing a small game works out. Yeah, I don't actually know like what would be most important. So let's just do it like that. I feel like that's a good combination of random uh, random bar slidings. Look at how higher design it is. Thank you. 
class in six weeks again. That's pretty expected. That's okay. Alright, I think that's gonna do it for us for now. We're gonna call that the end of the episode. If you wanna see more out of the series, hit the, the like button down at the bottom. Subscribe to us and uh, let us know down in the comments below. But for now, that's gonna do it. Till next time.